it's Nicole and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a day in my life vlog as a full-time student and content creator. If you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Nicole. I'm currently 18 years old, a senior in high school, and I do social media as a full-time job. I will forever be grateful for what I get to do, being able to get an education as well as work at the same time at this age. It could definitely get a little overwhelming and stressful at times, but usually when I plan my days and manage my time efficiently, it doesn't even feel like work because I just really enjoy what I do. So I thought I'd vlog and show you a little typical day in my life trying to balance it all. So I hope you guys enjoy this video, but before we get into it, here's a word from today's sponsor. You guys, guess what? I just got a package from White Fox Boutique and I'm so excited. So I think it's the perfect time to do a little haul and White Fox is actually sponsoring this video. So thank you so much to White Fox Boutique for sponsoring this video. I feel like you guys already know at this point, like literally my whole closet is White Fox and I always get questions and compliments about any of the pieces that I wear. So I'm so excited to show you guys all the new clothes that I got. White Fox Boutique also stocks White Fox Swim and White Fox Active. They offer free express shipping worldwide as well as afterpay to all US, Australian, and New Zealand customers. And you guys can use my discount code NICOLE for 15% off. But with all that being said, let's get into this White Fox Boutique try on haul. First things first, the PJ set and the zip up jacket I'm wearing. I love White Fox PJ sets with my whole heart. Not only are they so comfy to sleep in, but also just to like lounge around in the house, which I do all the time. But this one is adorable. It has red hearts all over it. It's a matching tank top and shorts. And then this zip up is super comfy and cozy. And then it says White Fox in this blue font. Next, I got these black denim jeans. I cannot wait to wear these out. They're so cute. They're low waisted, which are my favorite. And then this tank top, it's this little black tank. It says White Fox in the middle. I love the slim fit. White Fox clothes are so flattering. And also, I'm always in need of just like cute little tanks. So this is perfect. And of course, I had to get the same top, but in white and red as well. I think if you watch like any of my other White Fox hauls too, you'll notice if I like something, I'll just get it in a different color or design because White Fox offers so much and it's all so, so cute. Then I got this gray tube top. It says White Fox Sport Series 2013. I love me a good tube top. I think they're so flattering and such a fun top to wear out. Next, I got this black long sleeve. It says White Fox and then there's like this slit in the middle. This top is so unique and I don't have anything else in my closet like it, so I'm so excited to wear it. I could totally see myself wearing it for like a night out with friends. I also got this top, which is just a basic black long sleeve. I feel like this is a staple in my closet just because I can really wear it to any occasion. Like you can just style this up or down and personally, I just feel like it's an essential to have. Next, I got this tiny little blue tank top. I'm obsessed. I think it's so cute. I love this color. I think blue is definitely one of my favorite colors to wear and I just can't wait until California actually starts getting hot again so I can wear tops like these. I also got this blue long sleeve and you guys have definitely seen me wear this long sleeve from White Fox before because I have it in so many other colors. It's probably one of my favorite items that White Fox offers. I have it in black, white, gray, beige, pink, red, a lighter blue than this, and now brown as well. <laughs> I'm telling y'all, these are like the best shirts. I wish you guys could feel the fabric. It's so soft and so comfortable, but then at the same time, it like slims you up and it's just so flattering. Like I will never get over these long sleeves. Moving on to some bustiers and more of like the fancier tops. I save these when I have some special occasions or events to go to, starting with this one. You guys, look how freaking like beautiful this top is. Like the detailing goes crazy. It has like flower, lace, and satin detailing all in one. I'm just like, what the heck? Like I cannot wait to wear this out. Next, I got this bustier. I am loving these colors. It's like this light blue with some pink flowers. White Fox bustiers just never miss. Super flattering, such a nice fit, and I always feel so confident when I wear tops like these. White Fox does not come to freaking play. You guys, look at this top. Like, hello. I love this color. It's like a wine red. It has these lace detailings and then like a little slit, and I'm obsessed. Like, this is, it's perfection. Then I rated the oversized t-shirt section, and by rated, I mean rated. I love White Fox t-shirts so, so much. There are always so many different designs and colors to choose from and you can really wear them like anywhere you want. So starting with this one, I feel like this is just me in a shirt. Like it screams me. Then I got this one. It's more of like a blush pink color, which I really like. And it's from their limited edition collection. It has this graphic on the front and then also this on the back. Next oversized tee, I got this one from their leisure collection and it's in this like lavender pastel purple color. It's so pretty. I love the colors and like fonts that White Fox chooses like this bubble font like it's so cute then i got this gray t-shirt and it says white fox in this like letterman font i also have this in green so of course i had to get it in another color and last oversized tee i got is this one it has this huge 13 in the center and then also these stripes on the side i'm so excited to wear them to dance class perfect because as you guys know i've been back in the studio taking classes again and of course we need some cute outfits so thank you white fox moving on i got some sweaters as well this one is so cute and it's just so perfect especially for california weather right now it's actually 
actually raining as we speak and it's been storming a lot so you'll definitely catch me in this like i can't wait to wear this at school i like going to dinner with my family this one too this is a knit sweater and i'm so freaking comfortable right now now it's time for white fox loungewear white fox loungewear is where it's at their crew neck sweatshirts sweatpants sweat sets actually the comfiest and cutest things ever first i got this crew neck it says 13 right here it's this like white gray and then dark blue and then i also got these sweatpants it has the white fox logo right here and they're kind of just like open legged comfy lounge pants and i'm just obsessed like i feel like a big marshmallow right now like i'm so cozy and of course i couldn't not get a hoodie so i got this brown one and then it says white fox and a little cherry graphic right here it also has this graphic on the back but i love this color i love the red if y'all are looking for a hoodie that hoodies white fox is where it's at and last but not least i got this set i feel like an actual teddy bear right now and i like wish i could give you guys a hug but it's this super cute brown color and then there's pink writing all over it i will forever be a fan of white fox sets i wear these all the time to school to dance the airport to sleep you name it a white fox set is perfect and that is everything in this white fox boutique shine haul i am so so excited to wear all of these new items the link to their website as well as all the products that you just saw will be down below in the description box make sure to use my code nicole for 15 percent off site-wide thanks again to white fox boutique for sponsoring this video and now let's get back into it all right you guys time to get this day started today is thursday february 22nd it's currently 8 a.m and i'm on my way to school also peep my outfit i'm so comfy right now i'm just wearing this white fox crew neck and some lounge pants my first class doesn't start until 8 30 but i'm going a little bit earlier just to go to my math teacher's room and get some extra help because we have a quiz tomorrow i've been doing this throughout like my whole senior year basically just because i'm taking ap calculus ap at the moment and it's definitely not the easiest so any chance i get i ask him questions and ask for help but besides Besides that, today's gonna be a super easy day. I just have an econ test during second period. Last semester we were learning government, but then second semester we switch over to economics. So we have our first test of the semester. But I did all my studying. The material isn't that hard. Like it's actually pretty interesting to learn about. But once I get that test out of the way, my day should be a breeze. I actually have to leave school early today and I'll be missing my fourth period, which is ASB. Kind of sad because I love my ASB period, but I was invited to an event and I'll talk more about that later. But I will be having to miss a little bit of my school day. Okay, I just got to my school parking lot but before i go in i just wanted to give y'all a little senior year update first of all i love senior year so much like literally with my whole heart my class schedule is so easy compared to like my other years i love all of the people that i've been surrounding myself with and just overall i don't know i'm just so much happier this year okay there's my little update time for school see you guys in my math class Give me a sec. Oh. Yay! It's 11.30. Just got my off-campus pass. And I'm heading home. Literally, guys, every single day already feels like super short and super easy. But obviously, I'm leaving early today. So it felt even shorter. Gov test? No, not gov. Econ test went really well. I wasn't even expecting it to be that hard. And it wasn't. So I'm glad that was good. And then like my other classes, Calc we just reviewed for our quiz tomorrow. And then AP Lit, we finished the book that we were reading. We were reading The Awakening, which was like really short and actually a fun read. But, like literally for the past two weeks, our teacher has been like reading it to us. And it's been kind of fun. So we finished that today. And now it's time to leave. <gasps> Shady Bear, hi baby, cutest dog alive. Oh, baby. All right, now it is time to get ready for the event. I'm just gonna touch up my hair and my makeup and I'll show you guys my outfit in a second. But I was invited to a Marc Jacobs event today. They're launching a new perfume, a part of their Daisy collection, which is super exciting, but it's so cool. And I'm always really grateful to be able to go to these like brand events. Usually you get to look at their products, take some cute pictures, and then also like connect with other content creators. The event today is in Beverly Hills, which is like an hour away from where I live. So we're gonna leave soon. But another thing I've been really grateful for as well is also just how lenient and supportive my school has been 
over the years that I've been doing this and having social media as a job because there are some days like today where I have to miss school for events or for work like being on set so I've always made it a priority to like create good relationships with the teachers that I have even like the principal just so that you know they're like aware of what I do and also I can stay on top of all the work that I might miss but the event should be super cute today I love Marc Jacobs products especially a perfume so I'm excited to see what they're launching here's my outfit I just changed into this white fox floral bustier and then also some denim jeans but since it's like daily collection I thought like the flowers was a cute little thing. I don't know. But anyways, it is time to go. Okay, we are on our way. My mom and dad are also with me. Hey, bestie. Hello. <laughs> if you didn't know, my mom is my manager ever since I was nine. And my dad is my accountant. <laughs> it's a whole family business. But also, they're my best friends. So anytime I can bring them, they're with me. Just finished the event. That was actually such a cute little event. We got these little tote bags and inside they gave us a bouquet of daisy flowers and then also the perfume. Look how cute. I love flowers. I'm gonna put these in my room. And then here is their new perfume that they just launched. First of all, love the packaging. Daisy Wild Marc Jacobs. That was just so fun though. Like today was a perfect day. The sun is finally out because it's been like really cold, but it was at this like beautiful house with a really big backyard and the whole thing was just like really nice. Thank you, Marc Jacobs. Now we're heading to Rodeo Drive since we're in the Beverly Hills area. We're thinking of doing a little shopping. I don't know if I'll find anything but I definitely have fun going around to a few stores so time to do a little shopping guys guess where we're at we're at Air One if you live under a rock no I'm just kidding Air One's like this really expensive grocery store in LA like everything's overpriced here that's what, like what they're known for do you want some salmon oh my god yum yum Sushi? Okay, but they're also really known for the Hailey Bieber smoothie and I literally have wanted to try it so much because like I see it everywhere on social media I also had no clue that there was one in Beverly Hills, but we're gonna try some food in the Hailey Bieber smoothie and I'll be I'm gonna show you guys Moment of truth is Air One worth it. Here's the smoothie. And then also my parents got a bunch of food. We just got like some salads and like sushi. We're not gonna talk about how much it costs though because it's a little unreasonable. It's gotta be worth it. Cheers. Mm. Oh wow, <laughs> it's pretty yummy. <laughs> That's actually really good. $18. Oh my god. It's actually so good. <laughs> Wow. Okay, because I already love strawberry smoothies. And then there's like coconut. I think there's like glaze in there. I don't know what it is, but it's... Unfortunately, it's worth... Mm, I don't know. Worth $18. But it's pretty good. What do you guys think about the food? Good so far. Yeah? Salmon and ham rolls mm -hmm. with no rice. And then we got spicy cucumber rolls with no rice. Oh my god, yeah. Mm -hmm. Supposedly, all the food and like everything in there is really healthy and organic, so... I don't know. Living like the LA girlies right now. <laughs> Guys, I'm not even joking. The elevator just like closed on my dad. <laughs> He's fine, obviously, but like, it was just funny. But successful Little Rodeo drive trip. That was like such a little spontaneous adventure. Like we, we weren't even planning on going here. But we're going to the car now and we're going to head home. Oh my god, I forgot to tell you guys too. My freaking... Hayley Bieber drink. I Ooh. dropped it on the floor. Ten dollars of it spilled out. <laughs> More like fifteen. No, I know. I drank a lot of it and it was really good, but then I like held it by the cap, so it was solely my fault. But today was really fun, so. But we're gonna head home now. I think it's gonna take us like a little over an hour. So I will see you then. 
back home, back in my cozy crew neck. I'm actually going out to dinner with my family in like an hour or so, but before I do, I'm gonna submit my FAFSA. <laughs> FAFSA is like federal financial aid. I don't know if it's like mandatory, but like you should definitely do it. Like all the seniors that are applying to college right now, they should definitely submit their FAFSA and be eligible for financial aid or like scholarships and stuff. Um, And I haven't done it yet, so I need to get on it because I think the deadline's actually next week and it's very stupid of me if I don't submit this. I don't know why, like, I just haven't. I just haven't like sat down and done it. I got my apps done back in what like November and December and like those were out of the way. <laughs> I just haven't done this. So I've been putting it on my to-do list and we're finally doing it today. I know I need like a lot of my parents info though. So I might have to like go downstairs and ask them too. But yeah, I heard it doesn't take that long. So I'm just gonna sit here real quick, make sure that I finish it. <laughs> but for any of those wondering about college, I'll do a little college update right now. So I applied to 11 schools in total, three Cal States, eight UCs. I actually got one decision back from a Cal State. I won't tell you what school yet, but I did get in, which is pretty exciting. But I'm still waiting on the other 10 decisions and those come out in March. Don't worry, I'll be filming a whole decisions video, like filming my reactions to opening the emails. That one school though, that I got accepted into, I was just like checking my email and it was just there. Like the other ones, usually they tell you, oh, check your portal and it'll tell you if you got in or not. But, like that one, I was literally just scrolling through my email and I was like, oh, you got accepted. I was like, Wow, I got into college. But yeah, it's like really nerve wracking this waiting stage because a lot of other students are actually finding out what schools they're going to too because there's like early decision stuff, but I still have like another month until I know where I get in. So stay tuned if you want to find out with me. Again, I'll be filming all of the decision reactions that I get and I'll be posting it like soon after I get all of them. So anyways, I'm gonna finish the FAFSA and I'll see y'all in a bit. Time for family dinner. Question say hi. It really depends every single day what we have for dinner. Mom's been cooking home cooked meals like a lot this week but today we just wanted to go out because everyone's free and everyone's home at the same time because sometimes Yolo. and and you <laughs> that's another thing on how <laughs> how I like balance everything is spending time with my family and my friends because not every second is like work 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 you also need rest and to hang out with your loved ones so we're going out to eat this menu lights up this is like a content creator's dream menu <laughs> look at that <laughs> Obviously, it's a little later. Dinner was so, so good, by the way. That was our first time trying out that restaurant, and it's, like, really close to our house, but we loved it because we love steak. We were definitely a steak family, so we just got, like, some appetizers, some steak, and some sides, and it was really good. Oh, my gosh, and they have this butter cake for dessert. I love butter cake. So happy I got to spend time with my family, but we just got home. I took a shower. It's currently 9 p.m. at the moment. For the rest of the night, I have a bunch of work to do, not only for school, but also YouTube. So come along with me for a little productive evening and night. All right, not gonna lie. Your girl is definitely a little tired, but I have so much work to do. So we're gonna push through and get some work done. Also, it's probably not helping that I'm in my bed and doing work, but it's just too comfy not to be, so. We are here. First, I need to study for my math quiz tomorrow. I've said this in videos before on my channel, but basically the way that I study for math is looking over all of the notes that I took over this past unit, doing a bunch of practice problems, and then I also use the whiteboard method. Basically, the whiteboard method is just writing things down a bunch, a bunch of times until you remember it. So that could be formulas, it could be practicing problems and just redoing them. I also watched some videos from the Organic Chemistry Tutor. If y'all don't know his channel and you're taking a science or math class, let me put y'all on. I think maybe he does like other subjects too, but I just personally, I've used him for math and science and I love his videos. I use them to review and they're great. So I'm gonna do all those steps, make sure I feel prepared and confident for the quiz tomorrow. That should take me about like maybe an hour. And then I am going to edit this whole video, this video that I'm actually filming right now. Usually I like to be at least like one or two videos ahead, especially like with filming. Obviously my posting schedule is Tuesday and Friday. So I'll like to plan my videos out to be like, okay, I'm going to film this video a week in advance so that I have time to edit and then get it up. But life happens and sometimes I have to film and edit pretty last minute. So Loki feels like a vlogmas video. I filmed all day today and then I'm also going to edit it tonight to get it up tomorrow. Editing usually takes me around like three to four hours depending on how much footage and like how many edits i'm doing and honestly it could take me more than five hours but usually i feel like the average is like four hours so yeah it's gonna be a pretty busy night but definitely not complaining again i love what i do and i'm very very grateful for it all so i am literally just gonna be posted up here getting studying done and then editing done oh i also need to post on my snap story if you guys want to follow up my other socials at nicole Aino on all platforms i'm constantly posting on my instagram pinterest snapchat tiktok and it's like all different content too like instagram you can find more 
more dance content and dance videos on there. And then obviously like YouTube, you guys get more of like personal side of me when I post my vlogs. Okay, anyways, <laughs> enough rambling. I need to get started on some work. Let's do this thing. <laughs> so tired my voice is starting to sound like a man because i'm getting sleepy but this is where i'm gonna end today's vlog and finish everything on my to-do list today whoop, whoop. i just checked everything off of my notion to-do list and then also planned for tomorrow like set my agenda and everything but today was such a good day i hope you guys enjoyed a little typical day in my life as a full-time student and a content creator obviously every single day is different i don't have like an event to go to every single day or i'm not always like studying and editing every single night it differs but my schedule can get kind of busy but i'm totally here for it and i love everything that i get to do i'm gonna head to bed right now because i have school early in the morning tomorrow thanks again to white fox Boutique for sponsoring this video if you guys stayed till the end of this video comment down below like the smoothie cup because i tried the Hailey bieber smoothie today thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed make sure to like or comment down below subscribe to my channel subscribe to the family channel and turn all of my post notifications on i'll see you guys back with another video i love you guys so so much stay positive bye, bye.